The International Rally of the Pharaohs is kicking off in front of the majestic pyramids of Gizeh. The race is on with the first special stage of more than 400 kilometers between Cairo and the rally's first bivouac in Bahariya. Those who expected a gentle start into the competition will be surprised. Today, the race starts at full speed with some fast tracks, difficult navigation and some tricky spots to cross. On two wheels, the Chilean survivor Chaleco Lopez steps down around kilometer 120 because of problems with his clutch. The happy surprise of the day comes from Jordi Villadoms. The former KTM pilot has switched to Yamaha and comes in third position of the stage. Meanwhile, the young Polish rider Jakub Szygonski snatches the second place just behind the world champion Mark Koma. It's the first stage of this rally and it was nothing but easy. There was a lot of complicated navigation work to do and it was a long day, 350 kilometers of special stage. This shows that the Ferreros is a difficult one. On four wheels, despite two flat tires, Japanese driver Yun Mitsuhashi snatches the fourth place and takes the lead of the T2 category. Czech driver Miroslav Zapletal is playing safe on his BMW X3 as he is discovering the African rally raid adventure, but he manages to climb on the third step of the podium. The king of the desert remains the boss Jean-Louis Schlesser on his blue buggy. Today Schlesser has had to play it safe and open the track for his competitors. I went really fast when the track was safe and when I had good visibility. And then I thought, damn, the ones that follow me will be able to follow my tracks and to go fast where I had to be quite slow. In the end, Schlesser lost the top spot of the standing to the Russian newbies Vladimir Vasiliev and Vitaly Yevchikov. This first day has been tough for everyone, but beautiful. The race continues tomorrow in the Egyptian desert with a loop around Tibnia.